hey guys welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new look you guys see the title we're just gonna jump right into this video we're gonna check it out all i know is i see a guy and a girl on a date the caption says and they squared up so i'm like okay what's about to happen so let's just check this out and see what's going on Oh, shit! God damn! His neck. <laughs> that nigga, please! Hit that strike! That roll it! Strike. Roll the strike! That nigga sleep is over! He's sleep? Oh, she get him? Did she get the strike after that, son? You knock out your boyfriend and then pick up your bowling ball and get a strike? And then they just... Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me watch that again. I'm confused. I'm so confused. Oh, shit! Oh, my God! God. Damn! She hit him with the bowling ball! That nigga, please! Hit that strike! Roll it! He is passed out! Roll the strike! That nigga, sleep is over! Hold on! Hold on. <laughs> okay. And then with the same ball? She then rolls a strike. <laughs> His whole face is bloodied up. Nah, ain't no way. Ain't no way. There are so many things wrong with this video right now. First of all, I did not realize that she had hit him with a whole bowling ball. She, she pushed him by the neck, and then I'm thinking she just popped. Cause I'm like, how that gonna make him pass out? I'm like, she didn't look like she hit him that hard. She hit him with a whole bowling ball. What possesses a human being? And that's your man? Do you understand that that can instantly have killed him? And then, after hitting him, he was laying on the floor. Do you understand that there was a whole human being sitting right there with their legs in frame and didn't budge? Like, she didn't move like it was a normal Tuesday night. And then the kid recording. Are you freaking kidding me? Talking about he went night night and you're just still recording? This man could be dead on this ground right now, but you got your footage. You got your viral moment. I'm a boy mom. I am. So I don't know if that makes me feel differently about these type of situations. But if a girl hits you with a bowling ball? <laughs> The moment you get back up, you better throw two back at her. I know I am not supposed to tell a man to ever hit a woman. Please, I know, I know. That woman right there hit him like she had a penis between her legs. Then you need to treat her accordingly. But am I bugging? I think at that point, all bets are off. It's all fun and games when a woman hits a man. Cause let it have been him, who had hit her with a bowling ball? The helicopters would have been there already. Had this shit just walked away cursing like she was in the right, big and bad. Do you understand when I read the caption, I don't know if I am just so naive. When I read the caption, it says, man and his date argue in a bowling alley. All right. And lady used the bowling ball to eliminate him. I thought they were arguing and she used the bowling ball to win the game. Like she embarrassed him and put him to shame. Like, yeah, we fight in and now bow, hold the strike. I mean, she got the strike, but son, tell me what y'all think in the comments below because I, I am beside myself. She hit the man with a bowling ball in his head. Like, do I need to repeat that again? There is nothing to excuse that. Like, yo, you can't in any way, shape or form defend her behavior. You, I don't need to know what they were arguing about. She could have just found out he gave her eight. A bowling ball to somebody's head, like, that is attempted murder. Oh my God, call the cops. That is attempted murder. And you know what? The problem is, everybody sitting there is clearly used to them fighting. He probably got up, went to the bathroom, washed his eyebrow off, went home, and they got in bed together. And she, she probably was probably kissing the bruise, like, baby, you know, you just need to act right next time. You know what I'm saying? Just don't be talking to me like that in the street next time. And that's, that's probably the dynamics of their relationship. That right there is a situation where that man gets abused because ain't no way. If it wasn't the other way around, they would've, she would've 
I don't even think she'd have had the balls to pick up a bowling ball to hit him if he was abusive to her. Because she would then know that this man's gonna kill me when he gets up off that ground. I don't think she was afraid of that at all. You know when you're in an argument, you're in a situation, I understand there's moments of passion or you just did something so quick without thinking. That seemed like there was a thought process there. There was an argument, there was talking, there was a push, and then there was an arm that came up. Maybe did she forget the bowling ball was in her hand? Maybe she forgot it was in her hand. Nah, because then afterwards, her reaction wasn't on some, oh my God, I just effed up. It was a, I'm about to go get this strike right now. And then she got the strike, so her ego went from here to here. And he's sitting there on the camera, bigging her up like, oh, like what? He went night night? Yo, everybody in that camera, in that video, needs to needs to needs to catch a fade like do it on the camera you're disgusting you're a low life whoever that was sitting down like ill 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 if i was sitting there and then somebody just got hit with a bowling ball and then fell to the floor right at my feet what would i do at the very least i'm gonna jump up like oh my god oh my god oh my god what are you doing oh my god is he okay something son they didn't move like this is what y'all do i don't know man this is, this is what it's like outside? I don't need to be there. I'm gonna stay inside where it is warm and safe. Mm, I don't know what kind of water y'all drinking. I drink Essentia. I think you need to switch brands because that Poland Spring ain't doing you right. Sir, I hope you sue this woman. I hope you leave this woman. I hope you do something. For anybody watching this, this is not a joking matter at all. Women hating men is not cute. It's not funny. It's not playful banter. It's not something to be joked about. He got hit in the head with a bowling ball, and then when he was on the floor, nobody gave a damn. Because why? He's a man? It's not that serious? You should be alright? It's just a bowling ball? A girl hit you? Honestly, we cannot keep letting men go to the side like that, man. We cannot keep pushing their emotions and their feelings and their well-being to the side because we think men are men. I like my man to be a manly man, don't get me wrong. I like him to be, you know, that dude who walk in the room like, what's up? But not everyone's like that. Not everybody can defend themselves. Not everybody has that, um, don't F with me attitude. We gotta look out for them. I watched this video. Like I said, I didn't expect this. I didn't know what, I, I didn't know what was going on. I thought this was a bowling pitter patter. They started bowling and then she beat him in the game. And yeah, there was an argument. I did not think that this chick was taking a bowling ball to go knock this man out. Like I said, attempted murder. If she has a job, she better be fired. If she has children, CPS better come get them. If he has a family, somebody better go see her. I'm just saying. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. This is why I'm gonna turn on the TV. The days you stay off of social media, I swear you be having so much pace because you don't see things like this. I scroll for entertainment. Entertain me, please, entertain me. This is not entertaining. This is domestic violence. She definitely tried to use that bowling ball to eliminate him and then Shorty walked off, still popping off at the mouth. Wrong and strong. This dude lifted himself off the ground bloody. It's one of those things where you don't even know who to be more mad at. The fact that they were fighting and she did something so incredibly stupid, or the people who seemingly are of sound body and mind who are just watching and do nothing. What's worse? I mean, obviously hating somebody with a bowling ball is worse. If you can just sit there and record a situation like that and then sit there talking about, oh, he went night-night or he's knocked out, whatever he said, oh, he sleep, whatever he said. And you just keep recording, something's wrong with your mental state. You ain't right. You ain't right in the head. This is just some Twilight Zone behavior because the way people didn't react, you would have thought it didn't happen. Maybe she hit air. Maybe it's not, maybe, maybe it's CGI. This didn't happen. So tell me what you guys think in the comments below. What would you have done? Would you record this? Now, if you if you do and you get up, what now? Are those her friends? They can't be his friends. He is he's clearly a victim. Cause she looks like she's bigger and she's stronger. And she don't give a damn. When you hit people with bowling balls in the head, you don't give a damn. You have nothing to lose. I gotta go sit back for a second. And the way I did not realize that he got hit with a bowling ball because I was confused. Oh my gosh. But yes, thank you guys so much for watching this video. And I will see you guys in my next video.
Bye.